Spanish moss, agroplants.org, uh, also known as Stilantia uh, usnoides. Uh, this epiphyt leaf plant, uh, it's perennial evergreen and can grow in a variety of climate, Mediterranean, subtropical, desert, or as a house plant. Except this uh, is growing hard in a zone of uh, 11 above, I would say even 12. Uh, the leaves, as you can see, it's uh, gray and uh, white. It's quite of cute if you touch it. It's like hairy and soft. And the, they are growing connected to each other. And there isn't really roots. Uh, it's mostly the leaves absorb the water. Uh, from rain, humidity or moisture. Uh, depend. Uh, prefer rain water. Don't uh, put regular water. It might cause uh, some problems. Uh, the flowers are green and purple or white. Except this uh, watering, uh, as I said, it can be by wash the plant or spray. Uh, in the hot summer, uh, once a week or twice a week, uh, depends on location. If it's in uh, more uh, more light winds, uh, there is. If you grow it indoor, even air condition might affect the uh, humidity and make it dry. So you should uh, more increase uh, the amount of water that you put, not the amount in each time, in each time, just to put more times because it's dry. It. Uh, in the winter, it will be every week or two weeks, something like this. And if you grow it uh, outside, of course, you don't need to add some water. If in the winter, it just will get the water. Uh, the easiest way to start to grow it is by or to buy a plant or just to cut one piece and just to start to grow it. Uh, some problems that might be, especially if you grow it outside, uh, it might be affected by aphids, fungal slugs or snails. And if sl slugs go on it, it's like this so disgusting, sorry. But it's really, really something that uh, not pleasant to see. Uh, the height will be as long as you give it to... It means that it really can grow very high, but you just need to let it. Uh, but each, uh, it's like a lot of plants connected to each other. Uh, the growth will be from, uh, in the right condition, medium growing, but uh, also slow growing, it's okay. Requires small amount of water, because I just explained how much you need to put. Do not overwater, it might cause some problem. And grow in half shade to full shade. So it means that if you grow it in your garden, uh, this is super nice, I saw it already, uh, people do it here. Uh, you grow like an avocado tree and you just put it in the middle and it's just grown. The, it's harder to put water because it's sometimes like this, but uh, it's still beautiful. Uh, blooming season can be most of the year, depends on the climate of course. So that's all from growplants.org. Don't forget to subscribe, visit our website and like this video. Hope you enjoy.